We beat you in football. Yeah. I'm going to beat you today too. I'm joking. No, no, no. no. Are you seeking the truth? Be honest. If I if so, look. Yeah. Would you if I show you yeah. that what you believe is false? Mm -hmm. Would you would you leave it? You cannot tell me that what I believe is false. That's it. Because there's no point speaking. No, it's no, no. Because no. you made up your mind. No, no. Listen. I'm saying to you, if I show you, no way. So you, you believe Jesus is God? Yeah. And you believe God, Jesus is the creator of everything. Yeah. Okay. And you believe God is the greatest. Yeah. Okay. And you believe God become a baby. Yeah. Okay. Baby is created. Mm -hmm. God is uncreated. Mm -hmm. So to say someone who's uncreated yeah. has no beginning, yeah. became created, mm -hmm. is called a paradox. Doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Do you accept that? Yeah. So therefore, what you believe is wrong. No, it's not wrong. Let me tell you, when you come to the legality of the world, yeah. No, 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 no. Before, no, before, no, 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 no. I'm coming. Let's you, go back. I allow you back. to. No, no, don't interrupt me, please. I just want to educate you a little bit. Yeah. But you make mistake. You make no, no, mistake. No, no, I don't make any mistake. When it come to God, yeah. When it come to this planet, God has given the earth to human beings, to you and I. Has you what given? God has given. Ah, uh, given, given. Yeah. yeah, given. Yeah, He has earth. given us. Yes. Yeah, you understand. Yes. And God, before God can come here. We human beings, we are spirit. We need this flesh to begin to live in this world. That's why when this body leaves, you can't see the spirit anymore. The spirit goes back to God. So, in other words, we need this flesh to be able to live in this planet. That's what we need. Can you take so, it? wait, I'm coming. When it comes to God... You're here already, when you coming? Yeah, no, no, listen, I'm, I'm just telling you something. Maybe you might, you might get something from this. So, when it comes to God, when God had a meeting with the Holy Spirit and Jesus Christ said, who will go for us? He said, Father, here am I, send me. So, God has to make, he has to respect the legal, the, the, the legal system of this world. So, the angel is also written in your Quran that the angel came to Mary, a virgin, somebody who hasn't, come, who hasn't known any man. So, Jesus was pregnant in the, under the influence of who the Who is pregnant? Spirit. You mean the Mary? The Mary. No, Mary. Yeah, Ma Mary, no, Jesus. yeah, Jesus. Mary was pregnant with of Jesus. Jesus. Of, with Jesus, yeah. yeah. Okay. With the influence of the Holy Spirit. Yeah. yeah. And, for example, I want to give this question back to you. For example... Now, before that, I have to yeah. go back to the point. In, in you the, my point. Yeah, I'm coming. In the whole universe, it's only Jesus Christ of Nazareth who, hold, who have that title. There is no other person who was pregnant the title of what? a father. The title? The, the title of say okay this let me let me bring you back so, so you're, preaching. you're preaching yeah. you're preaching you're preaching there's yeah. no church here yeah you know what i just showed you and you agreed with it then you went back to your uh, nonsense i respect yeah no it's not nonsense. listen i'll show you i'll show you show you yeah. is it possible yeah. for someone to be uncreated it has no beginning yeah uncreated mm -hmm. and at the same time to be created is it possible God can do anything. No, I'm not asking you. I'm asking you, is it possible? For, for human beings, no, no, it's uh, impossible. Bro, bro, it's possible yeah. for someone who has no beginning. It's uncreated. He has no beginning. What do you mean? Uh, I don't, that I don't God understand. has no beginning. The person that has no beginning. God has beginning or has no beginning? God has no beginning. No beginning. No beginning. So therefore, it's impossible to say someone who has no beginning, yeah. at the same time he had a beginning. Everything is possible. With God, all things are possible. So it's possible for you, God to exist and not exist at the same time? Yes. Take care of yourself. So you have religion, have religion. No, it's no, true. It's, uh, yeah, take care of yourself. So uh, no, no, no. like I do. No. You have religion. Take care. Wait, what I'm saying? How on the earth? Let me go back to well, like, okay. brothers and sisters. You know, like people are watching and the brothers are watching here. That's why sometimes it's a blame word to speak to some Christians. A man said to me, stand in front of the camera, say it's possible for God to exist and not exist at the same time. If it's a non existence, you cannot be God who is ever living. But the Christians, for the sake of rejecting Islam, they will come with the most unbelievable, irrational, illogical, impossible, nonsensical belief. Just rejected Islam. So, no, no, today I'm Are you one of them? No, uh, no, wait, 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 before I go. Before, let me finish my point here, please, please. So, my point here have you not noticed the Quran? You know, the Quran is powerful argument. Allah said about Mary and Jesus, Person might say, what does that mean? 
if both of them eat food, there cannot be the creator who is self-sufficient, who is not in need of food. If he's in need of food, he cannot be the same creator, he's self-sufficient all the times. It's a powerful, simple, rational argument. That's how the Quran is powerful. Our arguments sometimes they can play, but when it comes to Quran, bang! Well, understand? Just say one thing. But do you get what I said? Um, yeah, I agree with you. Well, anyway, yeah. so listen, this is what I think the deception of the, of the Muslims is, that you put all Christians as one monolith people. There are many... No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, no, no, I don't, by the no, way. You just said all Christians, they believe this. No, the Christians. Majority of... Um, no, there is there's a Catholic, there's born again. There is other Christians here. My point is that yeah. it's not the dividing line between Christians and Muslims, yeah? Yeah, yeah. The debate about Jesus being God yeah. came way before Islam. Yeah, you know that. So, what's the point? So, my point is that not all Christians are Trinitarians. And not ah, yeah, 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 yeah. So, do not put Christians in one... In ah, one. yeah, yes, yes. I understand but, that, yes. And don't right. let the Trinity deceive you to staying into Islam. That's yeah. my point. So, you are Unitarian? Yeah, I'm a Unitarian, yes. So, you believe there's only one God? Of course I believe in do you pray? Do you pray to Jesus? I pray to the Father. You pray to God directly? I pray to the Father. Jesus said, taught his disciples how to pray. He said, our Father... Who art in heaven. So what, who, what did Jesus teach? No, I'm asking. I said, do you pray to the Father directly? And I just explained to you. Or yeah. pray through Jesus? Pray to the Father. Directly, yeah? In the name of Jesus, yes. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You pray through Jesus. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So that's what I'm saying. And now what I would say to you, look. I, I would say to you, when you look to the, to the New 